this is the front desk. Oh, oh hi. Oh, oh thank goodness you. someone answered. Um. Hey, hey, hey. Shh, Dad, please. Um, I'm having a little bit of an emergency, and um, I kind of needed some help. Uh, me and my dad are in the hotel. Shh, Dad, please. Uh huh. Yeah. Um. So there was supposed to be a um. I don't know how I don't know how to put this, but a uh, a companion coming for my dad, and um, she got sick, and she's not able to come, and I was wondering. Yeah, I told you that already. I told you she's not coming. Please, just hold on a minute. So, uh, yeah, I had a a lady of the night on on route, and she has fallen ill. So what I'm hoping that you can help me with is, do you have like an escort service or a number or something that can maybe procure us uh, another one? Maybe. What, what do you think about that? Like a like a caregiver type person, or it's a certain kind of care. Yeah, um, it's just I don't know, not one you'd maybe want to talk about uh, in in public sometimes. Dad. Dad. Um. He's just okay, really just... he's really being a pain in my ass, and I was really hoping that you have. Somebody that you can call. He's he's by. I've seen him be with men. So I, if it's a dude, like yeah, that's that's fine. Shut up. I've seen you suck a dick before, old man. I'm so sorry about that. Okay, and what room? Oh no, what room are you guys staying in? I. Okay, I I'm not. I'm not ready to give you that information yet because I don't know. It, I don't know if you're cool yet or not. Um. Will you stop? Uh, I wonder, maybe, could you just, like, come up and maybe smoke a J with us or something, and then we'll hang out for a little bit, and we'll we'll see if it's all cool, and then maybe I'll... Well, shit, I'd have to tell you the room number for you to come up here, wouldn't I? Oh, man. Um, yeah, no, we don't, we don't have anything like that. I'm sorry, sir. Crack, it's really hitting me hard tonight. Sorry. Um, oh... I think, oh, oh, I think she's here. Hey, how are you? I'm suddenly feeling much better. Don't worry about it. Oh, good. Okay, come on in. Come on, come on. Dad. Oh, damn it. I lost her. Hi, thanks for calling Double Tree. How can I help you? Hey, um, I'm, I'm so sorry. I, I need a little bit of assistance. Dad. Shh, Dad, please be quiet for a minute. Oh my god. Um, okay, so we've got a bit of an issue. Me and my dad are in the hotel, and uh, we were supposed to have a... I, I don't know how to put this, but um, a companion come up for him, and they they called in sick. Like, these millennials just don't want to work, am I right? And she called in sick, uh, and she's not coming, and my dad is really pissed. So, so what, what I, I need from you is, I was wondering if you have, like, a number or a service that you're connected to, which maybe you could call someone for us and we can maybe get a, a replacement? Hello. Oh, damn! Shit! She caught on a lot quicker than the other one. How can I help you? Hi! How's it going? Oh, sweetie, I'm a little stressed out, um, but I was hoping that you could help me out and maybe uh, alleviate some of that a little bit. Um, so here's what's going on. My eight-year-old is coming down, and I'm going to tell you, uh, Gordo's got a glandular problem, and he's a lot bigger than other kids his age, and he's got a really deep voice. And he's, he's coming down, but he needs help. I'm not going to be there for a little bit, but I am going to be there eventually. So I've, I've pinned a $50 bill to his leg, and he's coming down the road to see you. And I was just wondering if you could just look after him for just a little bit. Hey, 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 shh, shh, sweetie, hi. I apologize, but we do not do that here. Shh, Gordo, hush. I'm sorry, ma'am, what was that? I said I apologize, but we don't do that here. 
You don't do that here? He doesn't vape that much. He's got a vape, but uh, he, he, he promises to do it outside. Oh, damn. Damn. <laughs> damn. She was not going for that bullshit. She was not buying it. Gordo, you're a terrible child. I regret the day you were born. <laughs>